and this is a good time to be all booked up. I'm Diana Friend here with my friend Kathy Jennings. Hi everybody. As you know, Kathy is my personal librarian and she makes wonderful book recommendations for me when I run out of things to read. And I'm in search of a new book, Kathy, and you have a good one to recommend. I it's do. It's called The Invisible Bridge by Julie Oranger. It is a long book. It's 600 pages. It's a saga. Set during the 1930s, both in Hungary and Paris, it encompasses a family of three brothers, two that travel, one to Paris, one to Rome, and what happens to them, there's a mystery involved with it, but it's also set during the Holocaust, and we all know what happens to the Holocaust. Um, these brothers are also Jewish, so they are sent mm -hmm. back to Hungary at a certain point in the book. While it is, much of it is very hard to read at that point, it does have a very good ending, and it keeps you, it, it makes you think, and it also haunts you. It's one of those books that you just can't put down, you want to finish, and when you do, you can't stop thinking about it. I love this book. This author, Julie Oranger, is she did a whole lot of um, research on this book. So if you are really interested in historical fiction and want a great book to read, The Invisible Bridge is the book for you. Well, I'm finding that I really like that combination of the historical fiction. The Paris Wife was that. Yes. And um, with 600 pages, that's a little bit of a departure from the last book we recommended, The Great Gatsby. <laughs> 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 but um, that sounds like something that would be worthwhile because even though uh, the historical things that happened that do uh, were such a tra travesty in our history, being able to personalize it, even through fiction, sounds like it's worth reading. It is. It's a book that you can really sink your teeth in and it makes you think. And that's the best kind of book, if you ask me. Okay. Well, that's another edition of All Booked Up. We are recommending The Invisible Bridge by Julie Hall.